Find the missing dimension of the cone. Round your answer to the nearest whole number. Okay, this is Southwest 212. Let's do some math. First thing I'm going to do is write the volume formula for a cone. So V equals pi r squared times h divided by 3. Now I'm going to plug in the pieces that I have. I have a volume, so I'm going to put the volume in right here where V is. So 200 goes in for V. I'm going to put in um, my radius. It gives me the diameter. When you have a line that goes all the way across a circle, it's the diameter. So I'm going to have to cut that in half to get the radius. So it'll be 4 for our radius. So pi times 4 squared times the height divided by 3. First thing I'm going to do to make this problem a little bit easier is to get rid of this divide by 3. I'm going to times both sides by 3. So that's going to get me 600 over here. And that's going to get me on this side pi 4 squared h. The 3's canceled out right here. All right, last step, I need to divide off the pi and the 4 squared that's being multiplied by the h. So I'm going to divide off pi and 4 squared. Then the other side, pi and 4 squared. And here's what that'll look like on the calculator. I'm going to type that in. So it'll be 600 divided by parentheses pi, 4 squared, and parentheses. You'll need to type in your calculator like that to make that work. I don't know if my calculator is in the right mode. But it looks like it worked. 11.9, we need to round up to that to the nearest hole, so it's about 12. Our height is about 12. I need to make that a wiggly equals to show that it was rounded. All right, that's some serious math right there. Over and out.